Good morning, dear brothers and sisters. Welcome to Santa Maria Goretti Parish. Let us pray the Angelus. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For, for, for to, to beseech, beseech thee, O Lord, Lord thy, thy grace into our hearts, that, that we to whom, whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your Son, was, was made known by the message of an angel, made by his passion and cross, be brought, be brought to the, the glory of his resurrection, resurrection through the, the same Christ, Christ our, our Lord. Lord. Amen. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Let us pray the Holy Rosary. I believe in one God, the, the Father, Father Almighty, Almighty, maker, maker of, of heaven and earth, earth of, of all things visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, light from light, true God from true God, begotten not made, consubstantial with the Father, through him all things were made, for us men and for our salvation. He came down from heaven, and by the Holy Spirit, was incarnate of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered death and was buried, and rose again on the third day in accordance with the Scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is adored and glorified, who has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic Church. I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins, and I look forward to the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Let us meditate on the five luminous mysteries. The first luminous mystery is the baptism of Jesus. We offer this mystery for all who are sick and suffering, especially those afflicted by COVID-19. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive, forgive us our sins, sins. Save, save us from, us from the, the fires, fires of hell, hell. And, and lead, lead all souls, souls to heaven, heaven especially those in most need, need of your mercy. mercy. The second luminous mystery is the wedding at Cana. We offer this mystery for those serving in the front lines, medical workers, hospital staff, security forces, pharma staff, supermarket and bank employees, the media, and also the leaders and servants in our church and our government. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. O, o my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins save, save us from the fires of hell, and, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. The third luminous mystery is the proclamation of the kingdom of God. We offer this mystery for countries that are greatly affected by the COVID-19 crisis, especially our country, the Philippines. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins, sins save, save us from the fires of hell, hell and, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. The fourth luminous mystery is the transfiguration. 
We offer this mystery for the protection of our families and loved ones from sickness, danger, and harm. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. O, o my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins save, save us from the fires of hell, and, and lead all souls, souls to heaven, heaven especially those in most need of your mercy. mercy. The fifth luminous mystery is the institution of the Holy Eucharist. We offer this mystery for the eternal repose of the souls of our dearly departed, especially those who had passed away because of this virus. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins, sins save, save us from, from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, the banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this body of tears. Turn them, most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. Then after these our exile, Show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries, of the Most Holy Rosary, of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. For the intention of our Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Padre Pio, pray for us. Santa Maria Goretti, pray for us. Oratio Imperata. God, our Father, we come to you in our need to ask your protection against the COVID-19 that has disturbed us and claimed many lives. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. Protect the medical experts and healthcare personnel that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health soon. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in this trying time to work for the good of all and to help those in need. We implore you to stop the spread of this virus and to save us from our fears. Grant all these through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. 
Our Lady, Held of the Sick. Pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel. Pray for us. San Roque. Pray for us. San Lorenzo Ruiz. Pray for us. San Pedro Calunzot. Pray for us. That in all things, God may be adored and glorified. Amen. Prayer to our patron. Saint Mary Goretti, strengthened by God's grace, you did not hesitate even at the age of 12 to sacrifice life itself to defend your virginal purity. Look graciously on the unhappy human race that has strayed far from the path of eternal salvation. Teach us all, especially our youth, the courage and the promptness that will help us avoid anything that could offend Jesus. Obtain for me a great horror of sin so that I may live a holy life on earth and win eternal glory in heaven. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be a world without end. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Santa Maria Goretti, pray for us. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning, dear brothers and sisters. Welcome to our celebration of the Holy Eucharist. We offer this Holy Mass for all who are celebrating their birthdays and wedding anniversaries, for those who are sick, especially with COVID-19, for all those who are serving in the front lines, medical workers, hospital staff, security forces, pharma staff, supermarket and bank employees, OFWs and seafarers, teachers and school administrators, the media, and also the leaders and servants in our church and our government. Thanksgiving of our donors and sponsors and all other intentions offered in this Eucharistic celebration and for the eternal repose of the souls of our dearly departed. Today, we celebrate the memorial of St. Agnes, Virgin and Martyr. Our Mass presider is Reverend Father Dave Concepcion. Behold, now she follows the Lamb who was crucified for us. Powerful in virginity, modesty her offering, a sacrifice on the altar of chastity. We begin our celebration in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. 
The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. To prepare ourselves to participate in the sacred mysteries, let us first call to mind our sins and humbly ask the Lord for His pardon and mercy. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts, in my words, in what I have done, in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask the Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us of our sins, and bring us all to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Almighty ever-living God, who choose what is weak in the world to confound the strong, mercifully grant that we who celebrate the heavenly birthday of your martyr, Saint Agnes, may follow her constantly in the faith through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the letter to the Hebrew. Jesus is always able to save those who approach God through him, since he lives forever to make intercession for them. It was fitting that we should have such a high priest, holy, innocent, undefiled, separated from sinners, higher than the heavens. He has no need as did the high priest to offer his sacrifice day after day, first for his own sins and then for those of the people. He did that once for all when he offered himself. For the law appoints men subject to weakness to be high priest. But the word of the oath which was taken after the law, appoints some son who has been made perfect forever. The main point of what has been said is this. We have such a high priest who has taken his seat at the right hand of the throne of the majesty in heaven, a minister of the sanctuary and of a true tabernacle, that the Lord, not man, set up. Now, every high priest is appointed to offer gifts and sacrifices. Thus, the necessity of this one also to have something to offer. If then he were on earth, he would not be a high priest, since there are those who offer gifts according to the law. They worship in a copy and shadow of the heavenly sanctuary, as Moses was warned when he was about to erect the tabernacle. For God says, See that you make everything according to the pattern shown you on the mountain. Now he has obtained so much more excellent a ministry as he is a mediator of a better covenant enacted on a better promises. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Here am I, Lord, I come to do your will. Here am I, Lord, I come to do your will. Sacrifice or oblation you wish not, but ears open to obedience you gave me. 
burnt offerings or sin offerings you sought not. Then said I, Behold, I come. Here am I, Lord. I come to do your will. In the written scroll it is prescribed for me. To do your will, O my God, is my delight, and your law is within my heart. Here am I, Lord. I come to do your will. I announce your justice in the vast assembly. I did not restrain my lips, as you, O Lord, know. Here am I, Lord. I come to do your will. May all who seek you exalt and be glad in you. And may those who love your salvation say ever, The Lord be glorified. Here am I, Lord. I come to do your will. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Our Savior Jesus Christ has destroyed death and brought life to light through the gospel. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus withdrew toward the sea with his disciples. A large crowd of people followed from Galilee and from Judea, Hearing what he was doing, a large number of people came to him also from Jerusalem, from Edomia, from beyond the Jordan, and from the neighborhood of Tyre and Sidon. He told his disciples to have a boat ready for him because of the crowd, so that they would not crush him. He had cured many and as a result, those who had diseases were pressing upon him to touch him. And whenever unclean spirits saw him, they would fall down before him and shout, You are the Son of God. He warned them sternly not to make him known. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. May mga bagay na mali yung sinabi pero naiintindihan mo. Halimbawa, Sabi ng batang nangungumpisal, Father, kumbinsyonan mo ako sapagkat ako'y nagkasala. Kumbinsyonan. Sabi, ano naman kumbinsyonan? Sounds like, bindisyonan mo pala ako. Ano pa? Basta yun, nadinig niya. No? Hindi niya maalala. Ano pa? Kumbinsyonan. Sabi ng isang kaibigan ko, dahil yung tatay niya ay nahihirapan ng umihi, sabi ng nanay daw niya, lalagyan daw ng caterer ang tatay mo. Ano po, ano? Alam mo ibig sabihin ng katheter, hindi pa ba no? Katheter. Kahapon, sabi ng classmate ko, sabi, meron nagpasa ng message, sabi ay, namatay ang asawa ko ay sabi, hindi daw pwedeng iburol. Kailangan daw ipar, ipamarinate ka agad. Ano ba? Ipamarinate. Ipamarinate. Naku, nakakatakot yun. Ipakirmate. Ano po? Alam niyong mali, pero nagkakaintindihan tayo. Ha? May mga bagay na ganon. May mga bagay na ganon. Pero bakit mo naintindihan? Kasi pinipilit mong intindihin. Inuulit ko, may mga bagay na mali, malayo sa putukan, sabi nga nila, 
Pero bakit mo naiintindihan? Sa simpleng kadahilin, kadahilanan, pinipilit mong intindihin. Kaya hindi tayo nagkakaintindihan kasi naiiwan tayo doon sa nakikita nating mali ng ibang tao. Nakikita nating mali. O mga bagay na ayaw natin na ginagawa pero ginagawa nila. At yun ang nagsasara ng pagkaintindi. Stephen Covey have said this, that you must learn to understand before seeking to be understood. Alam natin, sinabi din ni St. Francis yan. How much in us that we really try to understand others? How much in us when we try to go out of our own convenience and perhaps in our own world so that we will be able to understand others. Bakit ba ang Diyos sabi nga, nagkatawang tao? Hindi dahil hindi tayo naintindihan ng Diyos, kundi upang maintindihan natin kung gaano kalaki ang pagmamahal ng Diyos para sa atin. And the first reading would remind us that there is no other way to the Father except through Him. And even Jesus have said this, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Wala. As a priest, I can make an offering for you. As a priest, through my ministry, I can pronounce the words of forgiveness. But no priest, regardless how holy he is, can never say you are saved. Walang sino man. Tanging Diyos lang makapagsasabi niyan. Sapagkat kapangyarihan ng Diyos ang magligtas. Ano hindi natin naintindihan doon? Ano ang hindi mo naintindihan o ayaw mong intindihin na si Jesus lamang ang natatanging daan tungo sa Ama? Mga minamahal na mga kapatid, Mahirap bang intindihin na yung mga taong may sakit, halimbawa, nagtutulakan, nagpupumilit na hawakan si Jesus? Hindi. Kung naintindihan mo ang karamdaman nila at wala na silang pwedeng panghawakang iba at alam nila ang karanasan ng mga taong nakahipo man lamang kahit sa laylayan ay gumaling sa gitna ng matagal nilang karamdaman, Sino ang hindi magnanais o magnanasa magawa yun? Who among us will not try to do it? You know that the evil spirit will fall down and pronounce even and proclaim you are the Son of God. Who are we to deny the divinity of Christ? Ano hindi natin naiintindihan? Marahil nahihirapan ng ating mga matatandang magulang o yung mga dating matatanda ko ng paano may paliwanag. Pero nagsusumikap sila. Sabi nga, yung mga lumang simbahan punong-puno ng stained glasses. Bakit? Kasi alam natin na hindi naman lahat may kapasidad na, na magbasa na kahit bigyan mo yan ng Biblia. At least napakadaling ituro anong purpose ng mga stained glasses ang kwento ng pagliligtas ng Diyos. The story of our salvation. May mga may mga bagay-bagay. Sabi nga there are aids that can help us understand. Pero kahit gaano kadami yan, kahit gaano kalinaw yan, magsabi kayo doon sa mga taong ayaw umintindi, doon sa mga taong ayaw makinig, sadyang wala tayong magagawa. Ang itanong lang sa ating mga sarili, ako kaya? Nagsusumikap kaya ako? Nagsusumikap kaya ako? Lumalayo ba ang Diyos nung sinabi niyang, Uy, maghanda ka ng bangka para tayo ay hindi man lang maipit? Kasi kung ikaw ay nasa tubig, hanggang doon lang ang limitasyon ng tao na lumalapit sa kanya. 
My dear friends, God is not distancing Himself from us, but simply to make Himself more available for everyone. He is making Himself more available for everyone. Wag mo sabing ang Dios ay hindi nakikinig sa iyo. Wag mo sabihin ang Dios ay walang pakialam sa iyo. When He distances Himself from someone else, not because He do not want to heal them, but because He is making Himself more available for everyone. He is making Himself available for you. Ano ang hindi mo naintindihan? Ano ang hindi mo naintindihan? Mga minamahal na mga kapatid, in this time of pandemic, when the Eucharist, even though through online, is made available more for people, wala kang dahilan para hindi makinig ang reklamo nila, Father, nawala ang watch party. Nawala. What can we do about it? But perhaps you must learn to understand how it was made available. And for those who fail to avail, I think you know it is already your fault. Sapagkat hindi naman ibig sabihin kung merong pagkain sa iyong hapag, mapipilit kang pakainin kung ano man na nandyan. Grace is always made available. Opportunities are always made available. Some of them, you cannot say, you cannot pronounce, but you know, all of these things, out of love for God, was made known and available for you. For those who are willing to listen, they can hear. Remember that. For those who are willing to listen, they can hear. And perhaps, they will be given the grace of understanding. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, to your goodness this bread to offer, fruit of the earth and work human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. By the mystery of this water in wine, we may come to share the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share in our humanity. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, to your goodness this wine to offer, fruit of the vine work human hands have made. It will become for us our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Lord God, we ask you to receive us and be pleased with the sacrifice we offer you with humble and contrite heart. Lord, wash away my iniquities and bless you. Pray, brothers and sisters, that this sacrifice of yours and mine be made acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. As we joyfully offer, O Lord, this day's sacrifice, recalling the heaven-sent victory of the blessed Saint Agnes, we proclaim by it your mighty deeds and rejoice at having gained her glorious intercession through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord Holy Father, 
Almighty and Eternal God, for the blood of your blessed martyr, Saint Agnes, poured out like Christ to glorify your name, shows support your marvelous works, by which in our weakness you perfect your power, and on the feeble bestow strength to bear you witness through Christ our Lord. And so with all the powers of heaven, we worship you constantly here on earth, and before your majesty without end, we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the founder of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew falls so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed, he entered willingly into his passion. He took bread, gave you thanks, broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more gave you thanks. Gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life in the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church is spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Broderick, our administrator, all the bishops and all the clergy. Father, please hear the prayers of your children gathered before your holy presence. Let's spend a few moments of silence and I invite you, brothers and sisters, that you personally ask the Lord for a special grace you want to receive in this Eucharistic celebration. Ask the Lord. Remember also all our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with Saint Agnes, with Santa Maria Goretti, and all the saints of Lisha throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Gathering all our prayers into one, let us now pray to the Father. In the very words our Lord Jesus Christ taught us, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. 
Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all unnecessary worries and distress as we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace, I leave you my peace, I give you. Kindly look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant us peace within our hearts, peace in our mind, peace in our own homes, in our own families, peace in our workplace, peace in our community, peace in our country and in the world, and grant unity in accordance with your will who lives and reign forever and ever. Amen. My brothers and sisters, the peace of our Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us now bless one another by giving each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. This is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are you who are invited here to receive him in holy communion. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. An act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen.
Let us pray the prayer of Padre Pio Petrucina. Stay with me, Lord, for it is necessary to have your presence so that I do not forget you. You know how I easily abandon you. Stay with me, Lord, because I am weak and I need your strength, that I may not fall so often. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my life, and without you I am without fervor. Stay with me, Lord, for you are my light, and without you I am in darkness. Stay with me, Lord, to show me your will. Stay with me, Lord, so that I hear your voice and follow you. Stay with me, Lord, where I desire to love you very much and always be in your company. Stay with me, Lord, if you wish me to be faithful to you. Stay with me, Lord, for as poor as my soul is, I want it to be a place of consolation for you, a nest of love. Stay with me, Jesus, for it is getting late and the day is coming to a close and life passes, death, judgment, eternity approaches. It is necessary to renew my strength so that I will not stop along the way, and for that I need you. It is getting late and death approaches. I fear the darkness, the temptation, the dryness, the cross, the sorrows. Oh, how I need you, my Jesus, in this night of exile. Stay with me tonight, Jesus, in life with all its dangers, I need you. Let me recognize you as your disciples did at the breaking of the bread, so that the Eucharistic communion be the light which disperses the darkness, the force which sustains me, the unique joy of my heart. Stay with me, Lord, because at the hour of my death, I want to remain united to you, if not by communion, at least by grace and love. Stay with me, Jesus. I do not ask for divine consolation because I do not merit it. But the gift of your presence, oh yes, I ask this of you. Stay with me, Lord, for it is you alone I look for, your love, your grace, your will, your heart, your spirit, because I love you. And ask no other reward but to love you more and more. With a firm love, I will love you with all my heart while on earth and continue to love you perfectly during all eternity. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. As we draw everlasting joy, O Lord, from our participation in this sacrament and from the commemoration of the blessed Saint Agnes, we humbly implore that by your gift we may truly understand what you grant us to enact in diligent service through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer for a new Archbishop for the Archdiocese of Manila. Heavenly Father, you have blessed our Archdiocese time and again with good, holy, and learned, and wise shepherds who have led us ever closer to you. Aware of your profound love for us, we, bless, we ask you to bless us once again. Send us a good, holy, learned, and wise man to become our next Archbishop. Inspire us, the clergy, religious, and laity, to work generously with him so that we might grow together in your love and continue the good work you have begun in us for the sake of all people. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Prayer for our family. Dearest Father in heaven, bless our family and bless us with new beginnings. A smile upon our parents and surround our children with a soft mantle of your love. Teach every child of ours to follow in your footsteps and to live life in the ways of faith, hope, and charity. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Kindly mention your intentions. Please pray for your family.
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for Saint us. Saint Joseph, pray for Santa us. Santa Maria Goretti, pray for us. Please rise. Ang akin pong tauspusong pasasalamat sa patuloy na paghahandog, suporta, na pinagkakalob ninyo sa Santa Maria Goretti para magampanan ang aming mga tungkuling ipahayag ang mabuting balita. We would like to express our deepest gratitude for your continuous support through your love offerings, for your support in our isang kanin, isang ulam. Marami salamat po. We have posted the making of our Annunciation Chapel Huwag nyo na itanong bakit annunciation. Mahabang pagninila yon. But why we made the chapel? Because pag kayo po'y nagpakasal sa huwes, alam nyong more legal yan, but hindi yan moral. Civilly married is not a moral act. And the reason, kasi wala kayong pera, ano po, walang kung ano man, nagmamadali ka. And we, we, I would say God allowed this to happen because when God gives us the vision to have this chapel, I do not know how it will happen. But because of this pandemic, it was made possible. Hindi naman namin ginusto na yung nagre-rent ng lugar na yon aalis. It was made available and we convert it to a chapel. Parehas lang naman. Kung ikaw ay magpa, magpapakasal sa sibil, ano pa? why don't get married in the church? And we will make this available. Nagmamadali ka. Ano po? Basta alam mo lang kung ano yung tungkulin at pananagutan. Pwedeng kasal na walang misa. Ano po? Pwedeng kasal na walang misa. But you have to fulfill all the, the requirements. And for you not to have a reason para sabing kung ano man ang kadahilanan mo, walang pera, kung ano man. Ano po? Santa Maria Goretti will open its door for those who want to get married in the church for a minimal donation. Tumigil kayo ha? Yung mahilig sa libre, walang libre. Ano pa? But you have to give a very minimal donation. Ano pa? You have to do and fulfill the requirements. Pero ngayon, wala ka ng dahilan na hindi magpakasal sa simbahan. No. Salamat po doon sa mga tumulong para mabuo ito. Maraming salamat po. Silently, I do not know how it will happen. God made it happen. In crisis, we thrive. Anong hindi mo maintindihan? Saint Agnes, 12 years old. 12 years old. Made a stand for her faith, for what she believes. She was mocked, tortured, and she was beheaded because of it. Kung naintindihan ng 12-year-old ang pananampalataya, anong hindi mo maintindihan? Ang sagot lang doon ay, ayaw mo talagang intindihin. 
kung naiintindihan ng 12 years old na kasalanan ang hindi magsimba, na kasalanan ang gamitin ang pangalan ng Diyos sa maling pamamaraan, na kasalanan na ikaw ay kumuha ng Diyos-Diyosan, kasalanan ang hindi igalang ang iyong mga magulang, kasalanan ang pumatay, kasalanan, sabi nga ang makiapid, kasalanan ang magnakaw, kasalanan ang sabi nga magchismis to bear false witness, kasalanan ano po, ang magnasa ng hindi mo asawa at hindi mo pag-aari. Ano hindi mo maintindihan? Marahil yun po ang tanong ngayon. Ano ang ayaw kong intindihin? Through the intercession of St. Agnes, may God have mercy on us. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. We go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Hail Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy. Hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our signs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after these, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mary, Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. In the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. May virus pa, anong hindi mo naintindihan? Ingat po. <laughs>